as someone who's always had an opinion and willing to stand up for it, how do I tell the difference between the spiritual night and my ego-based? Right. Uh, um, without discernment, it's hard to tell sometimes. And sometimes you do need kinesiology. And you need to, if you can't do kinesiology, you find somebody who can, who asks in your behalf, you know. And that is a good question. That's a good question. Am I just being egoistic or, you know, what, see? Uh, you see the spiritual night come up in, a, in O'Reilly, the commentator, Fox News. I mean, he gets so indignant, you can just see the... <laughs> rapes a girl for six years and he gets two months in jail. And he's just burning with it, you know, <laughs> the indignation. Now, that's the spiritual night. It's the spiritual night. It comes up with emotion like that, see? And, and it seems to be like an indignity, an affront to God's justice. You know? Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes you can't tell. Sometimes it starts out as genuine spiritual uh, concern, and then the personality comes in and escalates it. Okay? Sometimes you see that with a rally. He starts out with a justifiable position, and then you can see the adrenaline come up about it. See, mm -hmm. So you got both working there. You got the personal ego. You also got a certain spiritual awareness. Uh, so when is it? <laughs> when is it the ego coming up? Is uh, I think the amount of emotion with it. I remember in World War II, we didn't have any emotion about anything. The kamikazes, you, you took them down, and they took you down. So what were you going to do with emotion? <laughs> Where's the place for emotion? There's no emotion involved. You die, they die. That's what war is all about. They get you. Or you get them. No emotion. I've been one second from death. The mind's about to explode. Neither one of us had any emotion about it. He says it might blow up. I says, yep. That was the end of the emotion. <laughs> <laughs> it's a fact. It might blow up. <laughs> so when you totally accept, yeah, you might blow up, there's no room left for emotion. Emotion is what you haven't completed on a thing.